wanted to make a song that felt as good as the way, that, that sounded as good as the way drugs felt. And uh, I was a really bad drug addict and I was talking about my problems and what my father thought about me. And, you know, after I got sober, I was like, man, it's a massive cry for help. But then I started realizing, like, when my father passed away a year ago, a year and a half ago, that it was almost like, I wonder what he was thinking. Trent was a little bit lighter when I joined with Pretty Hate Machine, uh -huh. but he wrote Head Like a Hole, and that was what convinced me to, to join. Because, you know, we, we didn't know if Nine Inch Nails was going to be big or not. We, we hoped. Yeah. But when, when I heard Head Like a Hole, I was like, that's the shit I'm into. Like, it wasn't necessarily like Ring Finger or something. Listening to the fans, you know, the fans were like, "What happened? Let's 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 have the crazy nutter that I used to be." Because I didn't, I, I wrote I wrote a lot of stuff uh, after I was sober, and I, I felt like it was too uh, polished or something. And when I asked the fans what they thought of the song "Mother E," they were like, "This is it. This is where we, we want the nutter. We don't want." together happy sober rich we want the nutter and i'm like well that guy's right here you know so i was very happy about that there's you know every night there's something amazing that happens or something just incredible like after all these years seeing people just enjoy themselves and have fun and get down to music. I mean, at the end of the day, and I am an entertainer, and uh, I understand that, but when people tell me that like songs really mean something to them, it just, it just makes me realize that this is why I do it. And, you know, it's obviously, you know, I mean, even when there was a ton of money in music, it wasn't necessarily the money that, that I started for. I started because I listened to, you know, Neil Diamond and Rolling Stone records when I was a kid. I couldn't believe that you could make a sound with an instrument and and uh, you know bring people to tears or bring make them angry or make them happy. Or, so when I started playing music, that was the goal. And then for people to say that it, it helps them or I that blows my mind. I'm, I'm glad I'm allowed to party. My favorite horror movie is Seven, probably. Or um, the the original Blair Witch. That freaked me out. Like that movie freaked me out. I was scared to go in my own house and turn off the lights because it was so original. And um, The Shining, obviously, was a great movie. Uh, I can't name just one, but um, those are those are three big ones. I think. My favorite superhero is Superman because he can fly and do anything, he can travel in space and shoot people with lasers. I mean, there's really no stopping him, you know? I'd want to see the doors, probably put you two in there, Pink Floyd, the Deftones, Pantera. Um, my good friends, hell yeah, and uh, that's about it.
Hi, this is Richard Patrick from Filter, and I want you to watch my interview on aqdpie.com.